Hello everyone, this is Jay again and um, so in the last video what we have done is we have installed pfSense on Hyper-V in this video. This is a really quick video. In this video what we're going to do is we're going to change our WAN um, uh, IP address from DHCP to a static IP address. As you know that in the last video we have picked DHCP but if you, you would like to forward ports or uh, you don't want this IP address to be changed so it's really easy so click on uh, log on to your pfSense and then uh, interfaces go to van interface here it's van interface is enabled so ipv4 configuration it says dhcp so change it to static ipv4 and then in static ipv4 just give an ip address just make sure this ip address is not provided by dhcp so uh, on your home network which means it's not part of the DHCP range where it gives this IP address out you don't want this IP address out to be given to any other device on the network so just uh, keep that thing in mind so I know that I have 1.13 IP address available and it's not taken by any other device on the network so I'm gonna give it uh, 24 so it depends on the your home router setup is it 24 or slash 24 or different uh, usually the home routers they have slash 24 setup with the ip address something like that so if your ip address is different just uh, try to put it in the same range okay so the next step is add a new gateway so what is a new gateway so it will not work let's save this as it is apply changes All right, changes has been applied. We go to diagnostics, uh, ping, and then put 8.8, .8 and ping. Okay, so in our test now, so it did not ping. So the reason being is we haven't provided um, gateway. So go back, back to your WAN interface settings so in gateway so you have to put a gateway so you don't know what gateway you have to put so what you can do is go back to your control panel and go back to uh, your network adapter settings in network adapter look at your external virtual switch which is connected to pfSense in here settings and external virtual switch this is our WAN connection external virtual switch so you go back to your pfSense again sorry you go back to uh, network settings again double click on your external virtual switch and details in details you see ipv4 default gateway so which is 192.168.1.1 so this is going to be our gateway all right so gateway and new gateway name it van gateway and just type it in your address add it has been added save and then apply changes changes has been applied click status and I'm oh, sorry diagnostics and ping let's try 8.8.8.8 .8 ping there you go so now it's static IP address and it's um, connecting to the internet as well thanks for watching that video if you have any question in regards to this so please leave a comment and i'm more than happy to help you further and if this video helped you so please like this video thanks a lot for watching i'm looking forward to more videos in future thank you bye